Okay guys, well I got my package in the mail today, so this is going to be a quick unboxing video of the EVGA GTX 550 Ti 1GB GDDR5 version. Uh, it's a overall good card. I also have 16 gigs of Kingston HyperX DDDR3 running at 1333 MHz. Cache latency of... 99924. Okay, uh, this card here, it's got 192 CUDA cores. The GPU runs at 951 megahertz. This is the Fermi based chipset of the GPU. Uh, it's got a shader clock of 1903. You got a 1 gig GDDR5 192 bit running at 1456 effective megahertz. 104.5 gigabit memory bandwidth, PCI Express 2.0, 16 times. Uh, we have dual DVI and mini HDMI. This card is SLI uh, compatible. Max resolution, we have 2048 by 1536, that is max analog. Max digital is 2560 by 1600. Um, take note that a minimum requirement of a power supply for your complete system, not just the card, but minimum complete power supply is that has to be at least 400 watts. Okay, so let's, uh, I, I literally just got it, so I'm gonna grab my knife and we'll just carefully slit the film off. Okay, so there's the box again. So we'll crack the side of her open here and slide her out. Inside the package right away you have a DVI to uh, D uh, VGA 15 pin adapter. Oh, they got some pretty good packaging in here. All right. Also, they give you a two four pin Molex to six pin PCIe adapter. We have the EV uh, case thing here. We They give you EVGA stickers. You have the user guide, the driver CD, the quick start guide within the driver CD right here we got an EVGA sticker set this aside the card itself is in an anti-static bag okay so we'll just real quickly here pop this open and there's your card notice the nice fan here right at the top you have your SLI bridge up here at the top. You have dual DVI and again that mini HDMI. Your PCI Express 2.0 16 times uh, connector there, your bus. Nice back here, all the stickers and everything. On the back side you have your one, one six pin power connector and Nice ventilation here at the top. This is a dual slot GPU card, so keep in mind. And it's about, I believe it's about 11 or 10 inches in length, sorry. So, you know, a mid-size form factor case will do just fine. Okay, now I'm only going to open one stick of RAM here. I do have 16 gigs of it. So anyhow, I'm gonna open up this one. So as you see, it's got nice heat sinks on it. So I'll focus in on that. I don't know. There it goes. Kingston HyperX DDR3. Nice heat sink, full way around on the memory. Great buy. This will help me out. Awesome. So, video card and the RAM. So that is the quick unboxing video of the EVGA uh, GT GeForce GTX 550 Ti 1GB GDDR5 review along with the quick... <laughs> Kingston HyperX uh, DDDR3 1333 megahertz RAM. Hope you guys enjoyed and see you guys later.